What's your guess? What you got? Five fifty-five. Five fifty-five. Stock C seven Z stick car. I said five sixty-two. I might be a little high, but we'll check it out. Spinning on the dyno, so we just put some crap on it. Make it a Kyle starting his Monday off right with this crazy clean C7Z. What's this one getting? Just a hydrogen in intake. So just bolt ons. It's pretty simple. Yeah. That's it's the hardest part, probably the headers. Uh, yeah, the headers are kind of annoying. But um, yeah, there's like no room on these C7s. It's crazy. Yeah, it's not bad. It'll sound good. Yeah, definitely. <clears throat> Which is nice. Even if like uh, you can like actually disconnect the manifold from the first cat, and it's even easier to pull out. Gotcha. Similar to C6. I'd say C6 are a little bit easier. Mm -hmm. but is this getting a catted mid pipe or? I assume so. I don't know yet. Gotcha. I get the slip, but. I assume it's going to Really clean car.
So that's all one piece or what? The cat and the header? No, it comes, it's uh, two pieces. It is. So these things are about ready to come down. Yeah, we're almost there. Hopefully the headers go in. I think it went way easier. A lot easier, yeah. That stuff comes annoying shit. Mm -hmm. Looks like Kyle got these long tubes knocked out. Already on, installed on the car, looking good. Getting ready to do the mid fight. Yep. I guess that answers that. He is getting cats. Yep. Still should, it still should sound pretty good. Yeah. And he's getting a roto fab intake and then uh, Dynatin. I think, right? Yep. Good. Should pick up a little bit of power. You need me to hold it out so I can just let me know. I kind of like that ball and socket design kind of thing right there for, with the cook. Looks like it seals pretty good.
backwards to the black. Looks like Kyle got the long tube headers wrapped up, full exhaust is on. Moving on to the rotofab. Looking good. Big gulp air intake. Uh, it made 588 baseline manual car. So let's uh, see what we got. was because the com file I have wasn't for a big gulp and this has a big gulp on it. Five ninety seven and six thirty eight. Air fuel's good, but I got some timing obviously that I can put in it. Six forty one. It makes like the exact same boost the entire time, but right at the end, obviously because of the air intake, it like creeps up, makes like another pound over stock. Because generally with headers, it would decrease boost, um, but I guess obviously the air intake is going to increase it because it's less of a restriction. Um, on both parts, less of a restriction going in and less of a restriction coming out. So it's about equal, but I'm right at the top, I guess the stock air intake with the stop filter and all is fairly restrictive. So it, it makes like another pound up high. Twenty two, six thirty seven. We'll be back in a minute. 
I, it's a little warm, uh, but I made some changes to the file, and I'll, uh, I'll do this run, and then I'll let it cool down. was up though which is kind of what I figured obviously this thing's still hot so I'm mainly just making another pull to uh, see if the throttle stays open the whole way and then uh, go from there if it does then I'm gonna let it cool sit here and idle for a minute to try and uh, cool off the blower. They cool down quicker when the coolant's obviously circulating through them instead of just sitting there and hot coolant circulating. So it was at 111 when I ended the pull. Let's see what it's at now. 115. It's kind of what I figured because obviously you make a pull, it heats up during the pull and then cycles through. But I'll be right back. All right, see if throttle stays open all the way. If so, I'm going to let it cool. We'll be back. Oh, uh, it made 613, 646. Obviously, it's a little down on power because I made like 12 pulls and not 12 pulls, but like seven pulls in like less than 10 minutes, probably 15 minutes tops. We'll be back. All right, let this thing cool for like I don't know 40 minutes or so. Maybe one more. I thought it would pick up more being cold, but I guess no ported blower, all that stuff. The blower is not really crazy hot. I guess not like a stock blower isn't really going to pick up a ton being cold. Can you go click on that? I'll see if it goes to 626. Okay. So 626, 652. So picked up 26 plus 12, 38. Picked up 38 and I don't know what torque, a lot. Uh, it'll be right here. But 38 horsepower on intake headers and a tune. Uh, pretty solid. Uh, that's it. Later.